I'm Tony Okocha, the caretaker committee chairman of the All Progressives Congress in River State has expressed concerns over the security challenges and stagnation in the state during Governor Simnelai Fubara's first year in office. Okocha made this comment at the briefing held in Port Hackett, the state capital. I want a new project unique to him. Any project that he can franchise to himself. One, not the appropriation of a project or projects of the former government. Yes, government is a continuum. So, and I said to you again that you should compare, you compare what he has achieved in four months, because he said he has been in government for four months. Then he set up a committee to set up uh, uh, programs for the max is 365 days. Please, it's four months, 365 days. No, no. So we are in trouble in River State. It's an era of horror, stagnation. In River State, under Simulalaye Fabara, security is suspect. In River State, under Simulalaye Fabara, companies are living in droves. Industries are, are, are closing down because of a fear of the unknown. The achievement of Governor Fubara, known to me, is the fact that he has traversed 23 local government areas of River State in what he dubbed Thanksgiving for Supreme Court victory. Tony Okocha refuted claims circulating on social media that he congratulated the governor on his first anniversary in office. Now, he stated this was a lie from the pit of hell and the night having any falling out with Wike. Now, Okocha explained that he cannot congratulate a government he has described as being in the intensive care unit for the past 365 days. Reiterating his assessment of Fubara's zero scorecard, according to him, over the last year, Okocha, who has been calling for the governor's impeachment since March 2024, said the government's major prospect or project are meaningless since the budget he is spending from is considered illegitimate for not being presented to the full River State House of Assembly. What I just read as a document that emanated from the pit of hell is not only cruel and it is fake. I could not have congratulated a government that is in ICU. Not as to the question, worst case as chairman of the All Progressives Congress, River State. The governor of River State runs the budget, I mean, runs the state without the budget. So, do you want me to justify illegality? 500 and something billion? How did he get the empowerment? From where? 